Well, then it doesn't even matter that I'm not level 60. Alright. Don't worry about it. It's fine. Better than not using it in my own world where I made up how to play Shaman. Oh yeah, dogs. not live in this corner. Holy moly. I hate it there. I like that Weeper that I was trashing recently. Sometimes I hit Hex, or not Hex, kick. Mm -hmm. Just cause. I'm like, oh, he's casting. I should try and kick him. You know? I mean, I do. That's what I've been saying. When do I check my wall next? Uh, you can just save it for a Isn't he berserking now? No. Oh, he had an angry face. I command legions, mortal. What if I'm just subconsciously good at that? <laughs> Four, three, two, one. the wall that has a lot of other stuff going on. Alright, it's down. I will not forget to kick. Kicking, ascendancing, Jarl. That's gonna be a real problem. I request nothing. Yeah. You must overcome the Easy. <sighs> this is I'm just pulling this up so I have a record of the talent. These are the talents that I used. Um, there's from what I, Flabby's told me, you can use forceful winds if Ellie, if Ellie Blast is like too much to remember if you're like a new enhancement shaman. 
but um, I was doing Ellie Blast more or less okay. You're not supposed to cast it unless you have like an instant cast, but I was just kind of living my life. So here is a look at my damage breakdown for this encounter, and you can see here my top source of damage is Dark Light Ray, which is from this trinket. That's the Unblinking Gaze of Seath. I have the version from the normal raid. If you can get the Heroic or Mythic one, that's better, but any Unblinking Gaze of Seath is better than no unblinking gaze of Seath, and if you can be triple cleaving all of them and just getting procs, you're having a good day with that. Uh, my Potion of Unbridled Fury was also pretty good here, doing just under 6% of my damage, so I definitely recommend those if you're struggling for damage, and the rest of it's pretty straightforward. Elemental Blast is doing some work as well. Here's a look at the gear that I was wearing for this challenge. This is what my stat breakdown looks like inside of the Mage Tower instance with my consumes up. Um, we're looking at 324 Agi, and then I have 28% crit, 22% haste. Uh, the gear that I'm wearing, my strategy was largely just to buy crit haste greens, just Shadowlands greens, because they were cheap. You can do very well running Siege Borgamar, Throne of Thunder, and then throwing a bunch of main stat gems into them, but that sounded like a lot of work. Um, so I used what I had and then supplemented. So here's what I was wearing. I have my regular helmet, Heart of Azeroth neck, green random old raid thing. I think I got that while I was running HFC for the Iskar Trinket. Um, random green, random green, heirloom weapons. I put Shadowlands Enchants on those bad boys. Uh, random green, random raid piece. Crit haste with a socket wasn't too bad. That was from HFC, but you'll do better with the double socket or triple socket pieces. Crit haste, random blue, crit haste boots. Um, crit haste ring, crit haste ring with a socket that I believe was from the same raid. And then the trinkets are what's really important, or at least did a lot of work for me. So this is the Unblinking Gaze of Seath that is from HFC into Nan Jungle. You can use any version of it. The heroic and mythic ones are going to be better. This is the normal one and it did pretty good. And then this is the Dragon Spine Trophy that is from Gruul and Gruul's Lair. And that had quite good uptime for me as well. For consumes, I had the Greater Flask of the Currents. That's a BFA Alchemy Flask. It does give more main stat than the Shadowlands one, so that was pretty good. Um, I used Battle Scar to augment runes. The Veiled ones do the same amount of main stat. I just happened to not... I wasn't level 60. Um, and then I just used regular Shadowlands Haste Food because I was feeling cheap. Borellus Blood Sausage would be better. Um, and then I could have used a War Scroll of Fortitude, but I decided not to because, I, once again, kind of cheap. I did throw a Heavy Desolate Armor Kit onto my chest piece for a little bit of extra stamina.